right, so I've had a, a few of these motors come my way and I've got a few more as well, but uh, some are unbranded and I can't remember what the RPM was, but they all they all state um, a certain level of RPM. And I thought I thought I'd just do a quick video just to just to test a few of these and to see what they come out as, um, because you never you never quite know. You never quite know if the number on the on the motor actually corresponds to the actual RPM. So I've got this digital reader. I've seen some other ones as well um, that are pretty cool. But this is this is just a quick, quick and easy one. And you see on the uh, you see on the um, the pinion gear, you've got a little little stripe of reflective material, and that gets picked up by the laser. So let's just um, Let's just throw this into there. I'll put it in this little vise here just to make it a little bit more easy to easy to handle. So let's just tighten that up. Again, this is just a little fun little experiment just to see just to see what they all record. And I'll test. This is just fully charged, 11.1 um, .1 battery. So it's a really standard battery. There you go. It's a 1200 milliamp and um, 25C max discharge so let's put that on one side let's uh i'm trying to do all of this with uh with one set of hand ideally you just have this have this attached to a bench but um, i don't have a bench in here so let's stick that on auto okay so we shine we start them we start the motor actually yeah let's get into like that position there you go you can you can see it now so Thirty-one. Oh, oh! Let's get back on there. So, thirty-one and a half. Yeah. Yeah, thirty-one and a half. So, thirty-one seven. Now, a lot of these motors do do give a sort of like plus or minus a small percentage. I can't remember what it is. Maybe like one percent. I think. I can't remember now. But um, but yeah, they should be on. There's no reason for that to not be on. There, so 31k, 31 RPM at 11.1 volt. So that's good. You just stick that there. Here we've got the the T238. Now this is the this is a similar motor to this one. So it's their um, it's their it's their budget line. Um, and this says on here. It says two. 2520 kv now now that kv is different to the rpm so I'll, I'll look this one up a little bit later and find out what it uh what it actually says because i'm not entirely too sure the kv is the same as an rpm so um i think this is i think this is the lowest one they do is it a 25 i can't i really can't remember now and there's nothing on the box so i'll look that one up in a bit let's pause that Actually, let me look now. Don't go away. So this is the this is the 28k motor. So let's see, let's see what this uh, let's see what this says here. Get on there. Right. Okay. Get on there. Come on. Right. Here we go. Okay. Let's get ready. Right, okay, here we go. 27, 27, 27, 3. Yeah, 27, 3. So, yeah, it's close enough, isn't it? Okay, close enough. So, the last motor we've got here. Okay, let's take that out. Pop that there. Is uh, is this warhead? Uh, and this is this is a thirty-five k RPM one. So let's pop that in there. Okay, let's tighten this one. I'm not entirely too sure which if this is a base or if this is a what or whatever ones they do. Let's have a look. Pop that there. Pop that there. Okay, let's get that on there. Again, this is the no load 
no load RPM. So when you're going to pop this into your into your AEG, you're going to have a different rate of fire because it's obviously got some load on it. So um, it gets more complicated than that when you know when you start to take into torque. So let's um, let's get that going again. Pop that there. Okay. There we go. Thirty nine. Thirty. Thirty two. Thirty. Yeah. So around about thirty. There was our, I think it went up to uh, yeah thirty point two. So that's quite a quite a difference on on this one. And I have seen I have seen another post where someone did a, a similar one and got and got the same on another one. So I'm not entirely too sure if that's a KVM number or or what. It does say RPM there, but um, anyway, it's all interesting stuff. They they all work similar, um, but. Um, it's just I thought we'd have a quick look and uh, and see uh, and see what they they came out as. Um, I'm going to do some heat tests at some point um, with all three of them, all three of these ones, and see what we uh, and see what we get.